Hey, church family, friends, here we are just concluding kind of the, 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 the uh, peace week of Advent. And then tomorrow we'll do Christmas Eve and we'll light all the candles and that'll be awesome. And here's, here's what I want you to notice. All week the, the, the tense has been past tense, right? Um, God, God has shown us mercy and so we should have peace. God has saved us. He has brought salvation and so we should have peace. God has given us the ability to serve him without fear and so we should have peace. And today... Today in Zachariah's praise, the tense just switches, boom. And so the focus is um, it, 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 in the context of Christ, and everything Christ and God has given us. And it looks forward and it talks about John the prophet. And what I want us to notice today is that God uses people to guide us to peace in our lives. And so as we read through the passage, right, John the Baptist, he's the forerunner before Christ, brings uh, people to the, the path of peace. But in your life and in mine, uh, just think about people who've uh, brought you peace and, and, and helped you know about Christ better. Here, here's the text. And you, speaking of John the Baptist now, not Christ, child will be called a prophet of the Most High. For you will go before the Lord to prepare his ways, to give knowledge of salvation to his people and the forgiveness of their sins. Because of the tender mercy of our God, whereby the sunrise shall visit us from on high, to give light to those who sit in the darkness, in the shadow of death, and to guide our feet into the way of peace. And so, uh, look, we think about John the Baptist, man. John came that he could guide us to the path of peace. But uh, in, in our context, in our world, that, that's true. And, and the Bible guides us toward Christ and toward peace. But in your life and in mine, God still brings us people that help us find that path towards peace in our lives uh, and, and for his glory. And so today, as you get to Christmas, just let, let the knowledge that God is putting people in your life bring you extra peace this season.